The universe may not be expanding. When you first learn cosmology, you are told a simple story. The farther a galaxy is, the redder its light. Redder light is like the lower whistle of a train moving away. So distant galaxies must be rushing off, and the universe must be expanding. Part of that logic is correct. If a source moves away fast enough, its light will shift to red. That is the Doppler effect. But the reverse is not guaranteed. Seeing red light does not prove the source is running from you. A deeper tone could also come from an instrument that was tuned low from the very beginning. Energy filament theory, or EFT, takes this second option seriously. It says the cosmic redshift we see today looks less like trains escaping, and more like a giant drum that started out playing very slow beats. In EFT, the early universe is not empty space with a few particles. It is a boiling energy soup, extremely dense, extremely tense, and wild in every direction. The energy sea is pulled so tight that the internal rhythm of particles is heavily slowed down. That internal rhythm sets the color of the light they emit. Slow rhythm means redder light. Think of stretching a drum skin until it is stiff. The tighter it is, the harder it is to strike it quickly. The tempo of your drumming controls the pitch you hear. In the same way, the internal tempo of particles controls the frequency of light. As the universe cools, the overall tension drops. The energy sea slowly relaxes, structure forms, and the internal rhythm of particles speeds up. Our region today lives in a much looser sea, with a much faster natural tempo. Now we measure ancient light using today's faster rhythm as our standard. When we compare, everything from far away looks red shifted. Textbooks read this as galaxies racing away and space stretching. Eft reads it as a history of cosmic rhythm. Earlier soup, tighter sea, slower beats, naturally redder light. So the big question changes. Are we watching space itself swell, or are we comparing to very different tempos of the same cosmic ocean? This whole line of thought will need a full season to unpack. Next episode, what is the shape of the electron, and where do electric and magnetic fields really come from? Tap follow, share it on new physics, clear universe.